Mockingbird is officially here, ladies and gentlemen, and first deck, first test, nearly an 80% win rate. In Infinite, I climbed 8,000 ranks from 15K to 7K using this deck. Welcome in everyone. For those who do not know, my name is Guest, also known as It's Guest Gaming, and this, I'm looking the wrong way, but that's my screen. This is Patriot and Junk. It is a hybrid deck of Patriot and Junk. It's pretty self-explanatory in that aspect, but there's a couple of things here that Mockingbird is really enjoying. Number one, the demon that comes from the hood and the void that comes from the hood. I know what you're thinking. Wait, void on your side of the field? That's the old, you're losing 10 power, but you are getting down Mockingbird for cheaper? But yes, technically, temporarily, because then you send it over. Then you send it over. So you take advantage of it being cheap and then fire that thing over there because it no longer has a purpose for you, for your Mockingbird. But otherwise, if you take that junk package, just the three cards, you don't need to have Viper. If you don't have the season pass, Hope Summers, I would say probably then throw Viper into this and it would still work very similarly because you could also fire over rocks. Debris won me more games than I care to count in this initial deck. And I'm shocked that this worked as well as it did because yes, it's a Patriot build and you have your classic Patriot staples. You have your brood, you have your absorbing man, right? You have your Dr. Doom to go on in and spread wide also. You don't need Squirrel Girl to make Mockingbird a good card because all of those reductions are happening on turn three and turn four. And the thing that Hope Summers does in the deck is it gives you an out to accelerate faster through if you don't end up with the early combinations you're looking for. Putting down that Patriot at the very end is fantastic. Nice little way for a little surprise flare because people aren't necessarily expecting it. If you've gone with the full Annihilus package, for example, maybe you've played down, you ramped out a Doctor Doom, they're just kind of getting a feel for it and then all of a sudden Patriot comes to the party. But if you go the other direction, you play out your Mr. Sinister, you play out, play out your Brood, they're expecting, okay, it's a Patriot list, but they don't expect the five, six play of Annihilus and Sentry sending that big swing of power over two. It's a very deceptive deck that creates a lot of unique play lines. And I've got some games here to show the proof. We went 80% pretty much. Take a look. I'm gonna put up the image here from the video from untapped.gg of the tracking of it. It did really, really well in Infinite and I think is a competitive contender and a great alternative to just classic zoo that you're going to see in some capacity with a lot of mockingbirds. So here's something different. Here's something successful. I hope you all enjoy the gameplay. And if you like this type of content, please like and subscribe down below and we'll see y'all next time. Is Mockingbird a better buy than Proxima? Probably without even like knowing more than 45 minutes of playing the card. I'd say probably, but again, Proxima is very limited, and in the deck in which you would run her, she's good. So you have to take that with the grain of salt you wish to add to your coffee. Yeah, decking, the, the decks you can put her in is a much wider variety. That sucks. It's a Black Knight deck. Oh, for the love of everything, let me get this to land. Eat a dick, do 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 eat a dick, do 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 eat a dick, do 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 eat a dick. Um, Blade, you think you can win with your Hella? Huh? Huh? Let's see if you have the nuts. Minions to me.
<laughs> Adam. Whoopsie. How much do I want to bank on Annihilus? <laughs> like, should I play it in there now? I can't. I can't. I can't. Oh, <laughs> no. Fuck. Uh, because that's how it goes. No! Oh well. Oh, you're playing a Patriot deck. Fuck you. Oh. We're dancing to the wrong song. Oof. Hey, yeah, hey, hey, on my umbrella. Hey, yeah, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we can sneak into there with Debris Patriot. So I'm actually going to hold off. Oh, shoot. This is Peralta, the streamer. He's a Brazilian content creator. It took me a second to realize who it was. No, not that Peralta. both off. There it goes. Send the hood over. To me, that's way more valuable. Thank you, Soulstone. Because...
fuck! <sighs> oh, that's fun. Yes, Elsa Bloodstone got buffed. Victory. I know you never saw Patriot coming. There's no way you did. Unless if you watched my Mockingbird video. Honda. Hi. Yo, Mark. Wait! Oh! It's Mark! It's our boy! Mark 5 0! -oh! The one, the only! It's our boy! Oh, this makes me happy! He shall be here soon. And there's no way he's not running, not only a junk deck, but I would bet you anything, y'all. I would bet you anything he's running this one. <laughs> Wait, let's see. He's got a hood, right? He's got a hood. Hope Summers. Oh no, it's a wasp. Ooh, a straight up wasp. Okay, it's not the same deck. If it's a straight up wasp, it might be Patriot, right? That's a lot of Ds. Welcome on in. Uh, we'll call you Demon. Um, wait, 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 wait. Let's do. Let's do the load. Look at you. Look at you, buddy. I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. Ooh, let's go with, go with the big play here and then decide what to do. Hold on, hold on. So now you know, you gotta be 14 there. Now with a marble, it's very likely. No, Mark! No, I don't want to lose to Mark! He's my boy! Super Scrub. <laughs> Triskelion! Triskelion! Come on, Triskelion! Is it Super Scroll for the win? Is he going to be unnecessarily upset because Triskelion gave me this? It's plausible. Oh man, if he plays down Patriot 2. Oh, please play Patriot 2. Please. Yeah. Rock. Rock. Surfer. All right, now. No Patriot, but Super Scroll Triskelion for the win. All of the respect to you, man. I met Mark down in SnapCon, too. Mark is such a good dude, man. He's in here all the time. He always posts about coffee as well on Twitter. Every day, there's a coffee post. It's an yet another reason why we love him. Actually, it would have been close. I think, it would, I think they would have had that lane. No, I would have had that lane. I still would have had that lane if I had Nihilist. There's no reason to, though. Hello, Mark. Cat's the only cat who knows where it's at. Okay. Love this version. This is the Disney version. The Disney swing cover. The cave and Everybody. Yeah. 
Thank you. I mean... We just doom, right? So we just put this down for power? Oh yeah, we could alive. If they have a Jeff, though... That's a worrisome play. Because if they Jeff into Kiln, I lose. Right? Either or. Because I don't see any other way. Because if I Doom... It's a it's a safe win because of the Patriot on there. 